Hey, Addisina, what are you doing? Funny, Marcos. Actually, I'm trying to do some math. Do some math? It looks like you're trying to make a pizza. So this pizza has been cut into eight equal sized slices. Which means one slice can be represented by the fraction 1 8th. So if eight people were at our party and everyone gets one slice, how many pizza pies do we need? We can figure that out by adding 1 8th eight times. So that would be 1 8th plus 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 1 8th. <gasps> Plus one eighth. <laughs> that equals eight eighths. Which is equal to one whole pizza pie. That's right. Now you may remember that when we repeatedly add the same number over and over again, we can speed that up using multiplication. And we can do the same thing with fractions. We could just multiply one eighth by eight and get the same answer. Eight eighths, which is equal to one. Well, what if we want to have a bigger party for 32 total guests? and each person still wants one slice. How many pizza pies would we need? We could just multiply 1 8 by 32. The numerator of the answer would be 32. So 32 times 1 8 equals 32 8. There is one last step. We need to simplify the fraction. And we can do that by breaking it apart. Then this would become 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1. Which equals 4. So for 32 guests, all eating one slice, we need to order four pizzas. Exactly. Hey kids, if you want to watch this whole episode and more, tell your teacher to sign up at generationgenius.com. We cover all math topics, grades K through eight, and you get to watch it in class, but only if you tell your teacher.